welcome back on info for triple e and you are watching a series on basics of matlab symlink this is 35th lecture of this series in which we will learn to obtain matlab simulation results with different input values on single plot and you are with pramjit singh jamwal this video is based on the query of mr victor w in which he asked how can i save this information for variable runs of the simulation with different input parameters to be able to compare the results in this video we will continue the simulation we have created in ninth video of this series so first of all open that simulation and save this simulation with different name now open sine wave block this is the block at which i want to change the input value and i will select four value of amplitude that is 100 200 300 and 400 so initially i am taking 400 value and it close it now i observe its output so for run the simulation to get the clear picture I click on scale x and y axis limits and now i want to plot this value here i am having 1 2 3 4 5 cycles for more clarity i want to plot only one cycle so i will reduce the stop simulation time to 0.2 so update it to 0.0 0.2 now again on the simulation now i have only one cycle so to store this data i am going to command window and i am selecting variable o 4 in which i am transferring the value of o now i am updating the value of sine wave block amplitude from 400 to 300 again run the simulation and now store the output value in the variable o3 now again open sine block and update its amplitude to 200 again run the simulation and now store its value in variable o2 now again open sine block and update its amplitude to 100 and again run the simulation and now place this value in variable o1 now we have the value of simulation with four inputs that is 400 300 200 100 now we need to plot it simply write the command plot we have time in t and variable o4 i am starting with the higher value now now we have a one result in the plot to hold this result type the command hold now this plot is uh, held now we can plot the second result that is a plot o3 now we can check in our plot we have a two results in similar way we can plot o2 it is also plotted and again plot o1 so now you can clearly see that we have obtained the simulation results on a single plot 
at four values we can also define this color by inserting the legend first one is the sky blue that is a 400 next one is brown that is 300 third one is yellow it is at 200 and last one is purple that is at 100 so in this way you can plot your MATLAB summation results in a single plot to save these results with high resolution you can refer our this video now this is option for today I am thankful to Mr. Namdev Lepate for his appreciating words. If this video is useful to you, then like and share it. If you have any query or suggestions, then let me know through your comments. If you want to get the notification about our upcoming videos, then subscribe our channel and click on bell icon. Thank you for being with us.